You know, the weather is starting to get cold and people are often afraid of cold weather. I hear them sometimes say, oh, I'm so afraid of that cold weather. Others will huddle indoors like bears. I'm not a bear. I just have great hair. Thank you for tuning in to Metal Detective. This is the Toke edition. Join me as I do things like tie my shoes or put on my flannel jacket. Grab my keys. Grab my metal detecting gear. Flush the toilet. Put kids' drink boxes in the garbage. Lock the door. Lock the other door. Rip some grass and throw it in the air. Call Walt Siegenstein. Asking, what can I say? We'll always bring up a list of active commands. For sync support, call 1 877 945 3648 or see the tips available at www.syncmyride.com. Call Walt Degenstein. Please say a command. Call Walt. Calling Walt on cell. Metal Detective, episode 29. Anyugo Montoya. Did you kill my father? Prepare. Oh, no, I killed your father. I killed your father. You Prepare killed my... Stop taking words out of my mouth. <laughs> hey man, uh, yeah? I'm just... Uh, no, I'm just leaving. I had to have two sandwiches instead of one. It, it <laughs> I was hungrier than I thought. Hey, can you uh, pin drop me your location so I can drive right to it? I don't know how to do that. I don't have an iPhone. You can do that with any phone. Well, yeah. What do you do? Um, which phone? Which phone do you have? I have a E4. Oh. Uh, I think there's a share location. Uh, you know, don't worry about it, man. I'll figure it out. It's pretty easy. If you come down, uh, if you come down 33rd Street. Yeah. And turn uh, this. I should actually pull up the. You still there? Yeah, I'm here. Um. Thirty third Street. You said thirty yeah, fourth Street. Street. And then, well, of course, you tell me. Uh, and then turn if you're going down thirty third Street. Turn north on Avenue K, and it's right at the end of Avenue K. It's only like a block in from uh, from 33rd, and my vehicle's parked right there. Two big ball diamonds. I've already found a medallion with our Lord's Prayer on it. No way. Yeah. Oh, man. I should have skipped that second sandwich. <laughs> John's here too, so. What's that? John's here as well, so. Oh, sweet. Okay, I'll be there in about half an hour, right? Sounds great, buddy. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. I'm here, but it's unfortunately getting dark, which looks like I'm not gonna have too much time. But we'll give it a go anyway. Sad face. I can hear the beeping, Walt. The beeping going away. It's usually a good sign. Ah, oh, fresh air. Walt. <laughs> That's my... Oh, it's not even like the new ones. Like Is that like a flattened penny sort of style thing? Maybe. No, it's, it's not. It it's got deep. It was like eight inch. It was like eight inches. 
I can read the it. first letters. It says, O Father, our Father who art in heaven. So, Hallowed be, be thy, thy name, name. Thy, kingdom thy kingdom come, thy, thy will, will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespassers as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the glory, and power yours forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Sure. Hey, you think that trespasses, does that apply if we actually trespass onto like a... I, I don't know. But I think this is city land anyway, so... Ladies and gentlemen, we've got John Cave on the show, so feel free to get your friends to subscribe because he's on the show. If you don't know him, you might recognize him from such shows as... <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> Some help here. <laughs> we got this. I may have forgotten, but you know that guy that ran across the beach in that war movie? That was him. Oh, also, yeah. the uh, sniper. You don't really see him, but he sniped someone in another movie. That was Stated John. Ryan. Also, he was the stunt double for the stunt double in uh, Ace Ventura. In, uh, Rocky IV. <laughs> yeah, uh, he, yeah. <laughs> oh, you got me excited, Walt. I got myself excited because it didn't really look like silver, but. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Walt thought he hit silver before I even put my gear together. <laughs> I wouldn't have been mad, no. No, no, I would have been happy for Walt. I normally would let a few of these go by before I videotape, but seeing as it's going to be pitch black in 10 seconds, I might as well. Yay, aluminum foil. Got that out of the way. All right, so I did find it. It's uh, 1977, and we're looking at probably about six inches down. Let's keep it up. <laughs> no? I got a 43 coming the opposite direction. Uh. Which one? Aren't we curious still? Well, there's actually lots of deep hits over here. This 64 here. There's light over that way. I think yeah. I'm going to go hit the yeah. playground. Before. I think I'm going to he head beside the path here where there's some light. Okay. A couple shots anyway. You going to dig that one? Well, just this one. Because we've all three of us have gone over it. I just thought it's interesting. And noteworthy, so. Alright. So I dug this hole. And finally, I think we got what's in there out. It's not exactly, it's definitely not this little worm. Hey, get that lot off me, buddy! Yeah, sorry about that, dude. I didn't notice. I'm just looking for a coin or something. Man, that was an angry worm. Ah, no. Please tell me that's not it. Yeah, that was it. Wow, that was terrible. Oh. Maybe that wasn't it. Maybe it was my shovel. Yeah, that's probably because you suck. Ah, shut up, stupid worm. Unfortunate truth is, I did pull out garbage. Stop looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what do you got, Walt? Oh. I got a part of some eyeglasses. Cool. That part must still be in here. I think I broke it. Can you see what you're doing? <laughs> Do you need a pair of glasses? Put these on. <laughs> That's actually cool. They're not. They're like the round ones, eh? The old school. Wait a second. Here's the other piece. Is this gold? Hope not, because I broke the arm. There's the arm. <clears throat> well, it's a goldish color. And it says 10K. It. I mean, it says garbage right <laughs> it on says, there. It uh, says 24K. 
<laughs> that's you know what? It's probably gold plated. Uh, I doubt it. I don't know. What do you guys think? <laughs> is this gold or is it rubbish? <laughs> if it turns out to be rubbish, well, you get rubbish. If it turns out to be gold, good guess. <laughs> You get nothing. You get nothing. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in to Metal Detective. I'd like to end here, but I've somehow I'm going to keep digging. You can go for what's in the box. <laughs> <laughs> do you want to take the red snapper or go for what's in the box? I didn't know you could do accents. Well, Lacuni, I think I'll take what's in the box. And yeah. what is in the box? Nothing! In all my time metal detecting, I have never seen anything like this. But I can see it's wood. But it's reading as metal. I'm not even kidding. It's crazy. I have no idea. So that's the end of the night. Unfortunately... This is a dry episode. I don't even know if I'm going to post it. But after a while, me and Walt just sat down and talked. And that was extremely nice. It's a nice, cool night. No rain, no bugs. You see. And, uh, metal detective out.